everyone, it's Rishabh Jain from the Samyak Science Society and today I will be showing you how you can put your own paper slides or conventional research slides inside the Foldscope. If you want to learn how you can make your own paper slides at home, check the description down below for a video tutorial. With that, let's get started. First off, let's look at the materials that are required. We're going to need our fold scope, along with the different types of slides that we're trying to look at. First off, I'm going to look at the slides through this more recent version of the fold scope, but we'll also be taking a look at how to put them in the older versions of the fold scope, like this one here. So first, I'm going to gather my fold scope and turn it around to the yellow side. There's this back flap right here, which all we have to do is open. Once we open the back flap, you'll see that there's two little slits right here, with some arrows on them. This is where you're going to need to insert your slide. Let's start out with the conventional version of the slide, our plastic slide. I'm just going to locate the area in between this little flap right here and the surface below where the two arrows are pointing, and then slide the edge of the slide in. I'm going to close the flap. Now we can do that with the other flap. Zooming in here to see it a little bit clearer, we can look at this flap right here, which simply just has to open to accept the edge of the slide. You can push that through and center it exactly above the magnetic coupler center. This allows for a clear image and for us to be able to see our sample. Next, I'm just going to take my back cover that I let sit over here and close it up. The fold scope is now ready for use. Now we're going to take a look at how we can put our paper slide that we created in the last video inside one of the older versions of the fold scope. All we have to do is take the fold scope and locate these two edges right here and right here. This is where we're going to put our slide. Next, locate the bottom edge and place and push your slide through. Make sure it passes underneath the lens area and then push it through the other side where you can see the slit. I'm going to open it up from this side so it becomes a little bit easier for us to understand where to put our fold scope slide. I now notice that we can see the little pink area of our slide. This is where we can focus it and position it a little bit for a clearer image when we're looking at it underneath the microscope. Oh hey, I almost didn't catch you for a second there. Thanks for watching our tutorial on how you can put your paper slides or conventional plastic slides inside the fold scopes. We hope you really enjoy and check the description down below for how you can make your own paper slides at home, as well as any other information that you might need to know about the Foldscope. Thanks for watching.